I'm John Bryant with this afternoon's Kenosha News Minute, sponsored by Festival Foods. Marquis Tibbs decided not to withdraw his felony murder plea in last year's death of Anthony Edwards, despite learning an officer had planted evidence during a search. Kenosha's chief of police and the district attorney were among the officials called to testify in hearings about the problematic evidence. Tibbs pleaded no contest and will be sentenced next month. With the Kenosha streetcar expansion plan axed by the city, some local money set aside for it will now go to street repair, more than $2 million. Some of it will be done this year. However, the largest road project, some five blocks of 6th Avenue, won't be done until next year. A Kenosha man who shot and killed a friend in March pleaded guilty to first-degree reckless homicide Thursday. 29-year-old Roland Garza allegedly staged the accidental shooting to look like a suicide. He'll be sentenced in August. And this week's Fix It feature looks at continuing saga of rough railroad crossing on Highway 50. For more, check KenoshaNews.com and pick up the Kenosha News.